This is so overwhelming, okay. Mm -hmm. Good morning guys, we are going to Disneyland. I am so excited. You might be wondering, Disneyland is the happiest place on earth. How have you never been there? And the answer is, it's also the most expensive place on earth. So you can probably guess by the title, but it's six in the morning right now. And until tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. as well, I am only gonna be eating foods from Disneyland. So I'm basically gonna be spending the whole of today at Disneyland. I'm gonna be at Disneyland from seven in the morning all the way up to midnight, basically. It's like almost a full day. It's almost sad how seriously excited I am about this is because it's always been a dream of mine as a kid to go to Disneyland and it just, you know, it really is really expensive. I never had the chance to do it before so I am so happy right now that I'm finally gonna be doing this. My sister is also here, do you wanna come say hi? You've also never been to Disneyland before. Yeah, never. But are you excited? Yeah, very. I did hear that the food is very, very expensive. So what I think we should do is put the price tag of everything we're gonna eat the sun is rising right now, so we're just gonna go and get in our Uber and go to Disneyland. Yay! Yay! <laughs> This is the one that I wanted to get if I wasn't self conscious on everyone looking at me. Me if I was a hat. This place is called Market House, and I think this is where we're gonna get breakfast. I'm pretty sure this is a Starbucks because it smells like a Starbucks and it looks like it. Oh my god, guys, this is beautiful. Look at that. I think I might get this one for breakfast. But there's so many options. That's the only Starbucks logo that you can find. That's really weird, isn't it? I've officially got my Disneyland breakfast, and this is basically like Starbucks except they've got exclusive items for Disneyland so I tried to pick things that they don't have at the normal Starbucks so I'm gonna start with the cookies this has got like the Starbucks logo in the front but then in the back it says well I really try not to break it holy schnitzel that is beautiful these spot the difference games are becoming very difficult <laughs> that looks truly incredible i think this is called a shortbread strawberry cookie and it's like a double layer with jam in the middle strawberry jam time to reveal the second item that i chose for food this is freaking adorable <laughs> it smells so good and it's more chocolate than cookie if you look at the thickness of it it's literally more chocolate than cookie which i am here for some might say that this is too much sugar for breakfast but i guess you're only at disneyland once so i'm gonna enjoy it i say this about literally everything it's got the disney logo like everywhere which is very extra but exactly what you'd expect from disney do you remember the name of this drink is this strawberry something? Yeah, I think this is like an exclusive strawberry drink from the Disney menu. I'm gonna break this because I think this is gonna be so satisfying. I feel like a child is gonna come in here and start screaming at me. I'm like, I've got plenty of that in the comment section of my videos. Oh my God. It tastes like bubble gum. I've eaten the whole center with the strawberry jam. Did you want some of it? I guess you don't have an option anymore. I'm gonna try the Mickey Mouse strawberry frappuccino now. That's so sweet. And when I say that something is sweet, like I really mean it. Nobody wants to be healthy at Disneyland and this is a lot of sugar, but I loved it. I would have probably not ordered this on like a daily basis. And saving the very best one for last, here we've got the Mickey Mouse cookie. Should I break it again? No, I shouldn't do it. It's gonna ruin it. My sister's getting a photo of the cookie first because Instagram before my videos, of course, but then I'm gonna just eat it. Why is everything literally incredible? Oh my god, I can't. I'm sorry. When someone snatches your wig, me trying to improve my face, finally. Let's give this a try. I think this is white chocolate. Oh my god. The drink is really, really good, but I would say that my favorite one was the strawberry jam. This is really good. I don't know if they have this at Starbucks, like in a different shape. My sister's gonna try the cookie. What do you think? 
Yeah. You have to be loud. Really good. Which one's your favorite? This one, actually. That one's better, right? Yeah. All right, guys, so we're at Pirates of the Caribbean now. Are you excited? Yeah, very. I'm sitting on a ride thinking about food when we just had so much food. Do you think he's okay? Me when I skip lunch. Is he gonna drop again? I reckon yes. I only ate Pirates of the Caribbean foods for 24 hours. Give the video a like guys if you want to watch that. We actually booked lunch but it's a lot later on and we wanted to get some snacks because it's still like six hours till lunch. Not six but like a long time. So we actually bought some more items that are like breakfasty items. So I'm going to show you everything that we got. That is one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. I think the lady called this the Minnie Mouse apple. And it's freaking beautiful. It's so heavy, this should be actually illegal here. It's got caramel in the bottom, it's covered in chocolate, and I think this might be marshmallow, but I got something else as well. Let me show you before we try it. Me and my sister are gonna be sharing all the foods that I buy in this video. Oh, and I have, to, I have to tell you the prices as well. So this is the other item that I bought, and this is the most beautiful piece of edible anything I have ever seen. It's a Rice Krispie treat, as you can see on the outside, but then the front is covered in chocolate. Wow, that really is sour. It's not very sweet, which I wasn't expecting, but it's like, it's refreshing because you're at Disneyland, it's so hot, there's so many people, we're all sweating, and this is like very refreshing. It's not sweet at all, weirdly. Oh my God. Oh my God. I am in disbelief. Wow. Oh my God. You should have taken a photo of this. The Rice Krispie part, which is like 80% of it, it's really not that sweet. It's like very buttery and like delicious, but it doesn't have that much sugar. It's hard to believe, but then the front is got like so much sugar. It's like really good quality milk chocolate. So before I get back to that, which I will, I'm gonna try this one on camera. I just realized that I don't think I've ever tried a candied apple. And I think it's got like caramel on the inside. It's like a traditional candy apple. Is that how you pronounce it even? This is so overwhelming. Okay. Oh my god. This is healthy, right? Yeah. I mean, it's literally an apple. Oh my god. So messy to eat, but it's so worth it. I know it's an apple on the inside, but you can't even taste apple. You just taste so much sugar. I'm ready to go on every ride. <laughs> yep, it's marshmallow. And it's literally the best marshmallow I've ever had. Like it's got this like vanilla flavor. It's really good. It's seriously better than most marshmallows. I'm gonna try to remember to say the price of everything throughout the video. So the price of this breakfast was $29, which is very expensive for three items. But you know, it's Disneyland. I'm trying to protect my ears. Okay, I'm not nervous at all. I'm totally fine. So there's this going on right now, but this is the place that we're at and I think this is where I'm gonna get lunch because I actually like a lot of the items they sell and it's very quick. Most of the other places they have so many people. So this is kind of what the menu looks like. We sat down to eat our food and look at this little ducky here. Hey little ducky. It is finally lunch time and for lunch what we actually decided to do was just to go and grab like small bites. So I've got something that I got from the place I just showed you. But I also want to get a corn dog after just if I'm hungry. We didn't want to go to like a restaurant because one, the waiting times were insane. Two, you had to make a reservation. This looks incredible. This is a bowl of chili inside a freaking piece of bread like how crazy is that they also give you like the top and the inside so you can just dip it in the chili and eat it which is kind of what sold me on it and here we've got the kids menu kind of just wanted to show you what it looks like they give it to you in like a little paper bag like you're going to school so tracy just come back so we can film Ooh. i thought maybe it was gonna come with some toppings or cheese let's try the turkey hot dog 
Wow. I think they've got toppings and everything that you can put on top, but obviously it's very dry, but I'm just gonna eat the sausage for now. The bread is a little bit drier, but this is so worth it. I was so incredibly frustrated earlier because we went to Indiana Jones, which turned out to be my favorite ride. And as soon as we're getting on it, my camera stopped recording because the battery died. Imagine if I just buy it into this, like, like casually just walk around Disneyland. Like, it's so hot outside that the cheese on top actually melted. Mm. Wow, that's pretty good. Mm. I can't film this without biting this. Mm -hmm. mm. My sister was saying they have a pizza planet from Toy Story here. Do you want my orange juice? Can you try it on camera because I hate orange juice? Video. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what to say. It's actually very good, yeah. I had a hot dog, a regular one. You have to bite it close to the camera. Close to the microphone. Wow, your first mukbang and your first ASMR all in one. I actually really enjoyed lunch. It was just a little bit small because like the hot dog was so tiny. Was your hot dog tiny as well? Yeah. What was the price of all of this? $33. I think it was $33. We're gonna go on some more rides now. I'm not sure if we're gonna bring the camera if the rides are too crazy. I don't wanna like drop you guys. But it's not even 3 p.m. yet and we're practically gonna be here until midnight. So we've got a long way to go, a lot of foods to try. We're going to Space Mountain now. I'm really looking forward to this one because a lot of you guys said that this one is really good. Is it gonna go real fast? very very dark in there so you guys wouldn't be able to see anything but I would say that was probably my favorite one so far we spent the last two hours on rides but now we are freaking out because this is Pizza Planet from Toy Story which is probably my favorite like Disney movie ever this is so incredibly extra SpaceX is shook Elon Musk is retiring delivering refreshment to a thirsty galaxy so this is the menu for those of you interested this is the sailing at Pizza Planet. A whole pizza costs $39.99. The only thing out of this world here is literally the prices. Wow. This is the pizza area. There's so many people ordering. <laughs> and this is the salad area. Like literally not one single person here. So I think we get a tray. It's called the Supernova Pizza. And it's literally a cheeseburger on a slice of pizza. I've never seen anything like that. How could I ever say no to this beautiful creation? Wow. This is the best afternoon snack of my channel ever. Hopefully my sister's gonna let me try this because this is her afternoon snack. Apparently it's blackberry parfait. We were trying to find a table with good light so you could see the pizza in all of its glory. I wasn't even too hungry, but then I saw all these slices of pizza that it actually looks amazing and now I'm very hungry. So I'm really looking forward to this. Wow, it's pretty good. I've never had a cheeseburger pizza before, so I wasn't really sure what to expect from this. But I like it. The light is terrible, but I'm too hungry to move again, guys. I'm sorry. Mm. I think the Pizza Planet pizza is definitely the best thing I've tried so far. This is officially my favorite food at Disneyland. It's been the Pizza Planet pizza. And I really want to try the dessert if my sister lets me have some. We're probably going to have a very small dinner because this is a lot of food in one go. How amazing and satisfying does that look? Let me just get a spoon of it. That is... At least to me, this is insanely satisfying. I want to eat one of the eyeballs before I make my final decision. There's so many layers to this. Mm. 
it's so freaking weird but to me like this tastes like bubble gum as well like so many things have tasted like bubble gum so far this looks really cool the flavor is very subtle so I was a little bit disappointed with this but the pizza the pizza is everything the pizza alone is worth coming here over the food that I've tried so far in the video. Obviously I'm spending a lot of money because this is for the video and I want it to be great so you guys can have a good idea of the foods here. But if you just come and you just get one food, I would 100% recommend the pizza. I'm gonna be in a food coma after this and I'm not gonna eat anything until like tonight. I'm pretty sure that for the next like eight hours I'm not gonna eat anything. And next time I see you guys, it will probably be a lot later for dinner and hopefully it's gonna be dark. It's 7 p.m. I think and we are very tired right now. It's been such a long day I'm drinking coffee right now because I need caffeine. I need the extra energy because we still want to film dinner So we're gonna stay here actually until like midnight because I really want to do like the whole as long as I can here So next time I see you guys it will be dinner time. It will probably be a little bit darker but I'm gonna make good choices because I've already seen some things that I want to try. It looks so pretty at night I think this is probably like the nicest view of the whole like Disneyland park. I want to go into the Pixar Pier uh, and try to find something for dinner. I'm just gonna get something small. I just looked at myself in the camera and I look so freaking tired because we are exhausted. It's been such a long day. I thought I was gonna like it. I didn't realize I was gonna love it as much. It truly is like a magical place, a magical expensive place. I ate a lot of bread and a lot of sugar today, so I didn't want to get anything too big for dinner. But this is actually my last meal until tomorrow morning's breakfast, so I I also wanted to eat something because otherwise I'd get home and be super hungry. So this is what I got, a corn dog. This is like a proper American style corn dog. Look how thick that is. Wow, that is really thick. It sounds like it's gonna be so crispy as well. So I'm very excited for that. And then, and then it came with some crisps, which is great. I appreciate it, wasn't counting on it. And my sister had some pizza earlier, but she's done with it. And then we're probably gonna see the fireworks and then that's it for us for today because what a day. <laughs> It's more corn than sausage, wow. It's very salty, but in a good way. I couldn't even reach the sausage because it's got so much batter. Wow, that's so greasy, but very flavorful, obviously. It seems so big and heavy and two bites and it's practically gone. Why is this a story of my life? Some of these bits are a little bit doughy, but the sausage is the best part. I do like the corn. Uh, do you call it like a cornbread? Mm. I'm probably the first person ever doing this, but I removed the rest of the cornbread and I'm gonna eat it separately because Wow, this is so good Wow <laughs> Oh no Grease all over my phone. I think this is officially my last meal until tomorrow morning and that concludes, well, when I wake up, 24 hours of only Disneyland foods. As long as I wake up at like six in the morning, I'll be fine. No exaggerating, this is probably one of my favorite days of the whole summer. Like, it was honestly so much fun. Did you yeah. like it? Yeah. Definitely. Did you expect to like it? Mm, not as much as I did, no. Yeah, I also didn't think it was gonna like it as much as I did. I thought, oh, maybe it's because like we're older, like it's gonna be like a little bit for children but it was so fun don't leave the video just yet because i'm going to show you guys the fireworks because it's supposed to be like one of the best parts and i really want to show it to you guys but really quickly i just wanted to say that if you guys like this video please don't forget to give it a like also don't forget to subscribe and switch the notifications on because if they don't switch the notifications on youtube is not going to show them my videos and this is like the most important part about my channel did i forget something I always forget something. No. I don't think so. Oh, did you tell them about <laughs> the price? Yeah. Nine dollars fifty, and I didn't get a drink, so that's the price for just the hot dog and this. You know, an expensive day, an expensive video, 
But I'm gonna say it's worth it, you know, let's end this in positivity because I did have a good time. I was actually thinking that'd be so much fun if you guys did one thing for me, which is leave a comment down below in the comment section and let me know what is your favorite Disney movie because when I do my fictional food videos, I could come to this video for ideas. So leave loads of comments with your favorite Disney movies or TV shows. We also took so many Instagram photos today. So if you guys wanna go and watch them out, I'm gonna leave my Instagram down below and my sister's Instagram as well because she only agrees to being in these videos <laughs> if I credit her Instagram, otherwise she wouldn't be here. So go leave some love on the photos that we took at Disney. Let's go see the fireworks yeah. because we've got like 10 minutes. Thank you.